making sure that you're communicating your needs and desires when the time is right. And so, it, you know, it's interesting. I've, I've talked to a few women about this and, and a lot of times women think that guys just know what they're supposed to be doing. They think that guys know what kind of a relationship they want. They think guys know all these things and guys do not know these things, right? Guys have, everybody's been raised in different kinds of environments, especially if you're from a different part of the country or a different part of the world than each other, you guys might have vastly different ideas about what you should be doing in a relationship, what's appropriate, what is what you know you can get away with with another person right and so you need to make sure that you're communicating the right things you're you need to make sure you're communicating what you want and what your needs are and what your desires are you need to make sure that you're setting healthy boundaries making sure that you maintain those boundaries and you need to make sure that he knows what it is that you want. Otherwise, he's not going to know what to do there. I mean, he might kind of assume that he knows what you want, but he might be wrong, right? A lot of times guys think that they know what a woman wants and they try to give it to her and they end up totally screwing it up because they have no idea what they're supposed to be doing. And so you need to figure out how to communicate what's going on with you and what your needs are and what you want. And make sure, and I've talked about this in many other videos, but make sure that you don't sleep with guys without being exclusive and knowing what he wants as well. So you need to find out what he's looking for because you don't want there to be any confusion about what you're getting yourself into from the very beginning. So don't sleep with guys without being exclusive and knowing what he wants and knowing that he wants something more and don't move in with guys without making sure that you get a ring, some kind of ring on your finger if that's what you ultimately want. And so that, that's the, the, the thing about maintaining boundaries and communicating your needs. So remember that, remember that. Make sure that you're not moving, stop moving. I keep talking to all these women, stop moving into guys' places if you're not getting what it is that you want, okay? What you want is just as important, if not more important than what he wants, right? Because it's coming from you. And so you need to make sure that you're getting your needs and your desires taken care of first, right? Before you're making sure that he's getting his needs and desires taken care of. Because if you're not taking care of yourself and you're not making sure that your needs and desires are getting taken care of, you're going to end up feeling really bad and maybe end up getting really resentful in the relationship. And that is a bad way to go. You don't want to go down that route.